good morning family hope you all had a great weekend um so this is week four of my grape fast and i'm going to start with my alkaline water so i'm squeezing one lemon in my cup i have a big mug this morning but i'm not filling it with water okay guys and um then i'll add my distilled water that i bought because i don't drink the top water like that because it's not pure and i don't have a filter for my pipe yet so here goes happy monday i have 2000 mils of water for the day that i'll be drinking as i eat i don't know what i'll be doing this morning in terms of grapes i have seeded i have regular purple and i have black so i have an old drawer of grapes and i drank my water <clears throat> just my family food up there guys um, i'm the only one in grape fast in the house so the family have to eat so but i have my drawer of grapes so i'll let you see maybe i'll start with some grape juice i maybe blend some with water and because i don't think i want to clean up a juicer this morning uh or i may just eat some um and then juice some later but yeah every two to three hours i'm going to be eating my grapes and drinking my water and then start fasting again for 12 hours overnight no more eating of grapes overnight so so guys this is monday morning week four of the grape fast and i ate the first serving at eight um and i'm gonna blend the some of the purple one for the 10 o'clock or 11 o'clock serving so the blender my daughter tried to throw it out <laughs> as you can see and i have it and look at the new one and I didn't spend the time to use it, to understand how to use it. So the thought came to me, um, sometimes we hold on to the whole stuff. And even when the new thing come into our life, that's going to make our life much better. Because this new ninja, it's it will crush ice to snow. It It's like a... So as I was saying, guys, um, when new things come in our life, we're still holding on to the whole things and not, you know, utilizing the new things or the new persons that are going to take us to the next level of great success. So if you're like me, let us learn to let go of the things that no longer serve us that well, you know, and hold on to the new and learn to use it. And so that we can go to our next level. So have a fantastic day. And as we continue with the grape fast, um, week four, and it's doing its things, guys. It's doing it, its thing. You know, I'm feeling the cleanse. I'm seeing the cleanse. And I, I just want you to see it too as, as I go along. Just notice my skin. Notice, you know, everything changing. So at the six-week mark, we're going to see. And I'm also going to do some lab work afterwards. So I... See, I strain the pulp out. I blend like about 500 mils of water to about half a blender of grapes. That's my small blender. And here goes. I got about 700 mils. And this will serve for my 10.30 to 11. So it's about almost three hours and I'm just hungry. So sometimes you're not going to even want to eat at two hour mark. And it's okay to eat every three hours. So yeah. And the time to get some sunshine in, guys. Oh, the morning sun is not as hot. Oh, it itches a little sometimes when the sun gets really hot. Well, it's almost midday, so it's it's hotter than usual. Preferably, they say you should do the morning sun or the evening sun because it won't um, give you a tan and you'll get adequate vitamin D. Plus, the sun breaks down, um, help the liver to break down, detoxify your body, and you pee out the toxins. So get that sunshine in. I don't know what's happening in the north the last three years anyway, because um, it's mostly bleaky, cool days. So I'm longing for Florida, California, some island life for some sunshine. 
yeah, but I get the best I can as much as I can while I'm in the north, you know. So today I'm out on the deck getting some. Get it in. Great fast continues. Love you all. Guys, I need to screen my deck because the wasp and the bees are competing with me for the, the, the deck. And I'm not having it. I have my rag. I'm going to fan them away because this is my deck, okay? Um. So, yes. See one coming again. Ugh. Um, anyways, I, I just want to remind you also fresh air is good. So get outside, get that fresh air in because air, sunshine, it's not just food and exercise and, you know, making your food be your medicine. You also need the sunshine. You need the fresh air. You need nature. You need to swim in the lakes, the, the rivers, the sea, because we're from earth and we need to connect with the earth so that we can stay fully healthy and spiritually healthy and healthy in every way in all the alleys physically emotionally mentally you know if anyone know anything natural i can use to keep the bugs away in an open in a deck that not screened let me know because uh one of my daughter classmates did like a garlic olive oil soap mix i don't know if i mixed it wrong because i didn't get the actual formula and say spray it on the deck and it will keep them away but i spray it and it's not keeping them away okay so you know what you don't want to use the insect spray and stuff because you're out there sitting you don't want to inhale that so tell me a healthy natural diy that you can use to keep them away all right my last meal of the day freshly made homemade grape juice look at this nice beautiful purple and I don't need any more pulp for the day because I ate like about three servings of pulp. Um, and I have two servings of juice. One earlier today and this last one for the day. So have a fantastic night. See you tomorrow. I'm down to 157 point what did you see and I'm gonna drink my lemon water now good morning family good morning I'm doing this to water again with lemon juice I'm starting my day with my water you always drink your water first like about a whole glass full or 500 mils so I'm gonna do that my family so I'm drinking my lemon water whole lemon to clean out the bowels because you need to poop every day to get out the toxins that the grapes cleaning out of your body so this is week three and three days saturday i mean sunday monday tuesday so today's tuesday so it's three weeks three days so we're in week four okay and thanks for all who have come along on this journey to better health, to sustain good health. And I use my straw to drink the water to help protect your teeth from the, the lemon. Or if you don't use the straw, just drink some water right afterwards, which, which I'm gonna do as well. Huh? So I have drunk my room temperature water and um, it's now 5.40 a.m. And I'm getting my daughter ready for the bus stop. I'm going to make her some breakfast and then I will have my grapes. It's an early day for me today. So 12 hours of eating grapes and water only, room temperature water. You don't want to do cold icy water. It's not good for the system, especially on a, on a fast. It will cause your blood vessels to contract, your intestine to contract. And that may make you have unnecessary pain, things not dissolving properly, you know, because cold freezes stuff. So catch you later. Then I'll start my day with my grapes after my water. So love you all and have a blessed day now. And don't let anything spoil your day. All right. Blessings. Full in my water bottle for the day. So, see, it even complies with my grape fast. 12 hours of drinking water, 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. So, by 8 p.m., I will finish drinking my water. 
and my eating my grapes and that's the all the eating for the day and then fasting again overnight so the journey continues and yes let's go for the great fast this water bottle is pretty cool if you have a water bottle like this for the day that should see 2200 mils right there you go if you can drink that for the day you have drunk enough water you prevent your kidneys from brain damage. You protect your, you know, flush your system. Keep your yourself healthy because we need to drink enough clean water every day. So at least if you're an adult, 2,200 mils, that's like about um, four to five bottles of water. Um, if you're a child, like um, in your teens or 10, 8, 7, they can drink two you know, 1,000 mils of water because they're drinking other liquids as well for the day. So half the amount for a teenager, you know, like 12, 13, 14. But once you reach 16, you can drink the adult amount. So I have like 700 mils of grape juice that I made last night. So this, I will start my day with this. Okay. I won't drink all of this. Maybe I'll drink three quarters and then leave a quarter for the next serving and also eat some grapes. So every two to three hours, I'm going to be eating grapes throughout the day and stop eating about 8 or 9 p.m. there about as long as I do 12 hours of eating grapes and drinking room temperature water. And the grape fast continues. Hi, family. How is your day going? My day was a bit tiresome. I had to get an evening nap and look, because of that, my water is not finished. I didn't drink any from 2 p.m. and it's now 8.30. So guess what? I can drink this all in an hour time because I'll stop. I don't like to drink water close to bedtime. That's not good for your bladder. You will, you're putting yourself at risk for um, urinary tract infection when your bladder is full overnight. Um, so yeah, and I'm going to eat my last servings of grapes. So I hope you all had a great day. And if it was busy like mine, I hope you can go get some rest now because we need to get our rest in. Love you all and catch you tomorrow. Also, I need to check to see your comments and questions and see how many I can answer also before I go to bed. I family, I'm going to have a little bunch of grapes here, the black ones. I'm going to wash these and it's now two... Well, 1.47 p.m. This is going to be what I'm going to be eating for this serving. I'm starving. I was making content for you guys and I forgot to eat my grapes. So I'm starving. So I'm going to wash these and then eat them. Catch you later. Hi, family. How is it going? It's time for my next serving of grapes and i've been drinking my water see i'm doing way better today i'm all the way down to the bottom i even drink faster than expected i'm down to 6 p.m and it's just about 2 p.m so i'm eating some black grapes see i got my little bowl and because it's so filling because of the fiber i don't need to eat all of this at once it's not that sweet it's fresh tangy so not all of them types of grapes are sweet. Sometimes they're fresh, tangy. Um, my head has shrunken. This is my daughter's cap. It was a bit tight. Now I just swallowed my head up. My belly is detoxing. It's shaving off all the fat from up the upper part. Mental health talk for the for the day. Um, be your biggest supporter. Don't give up on yourself. Don't give up on your dreams. Work at it every day. Um, don't let anyone uh, deter you from your dreams. If you want to be a business owner, be a business owner. Okay? Don't let anyone deter you. If you want to go start a farm, go start your farm. Baby steps at a time. Join with people who are farmers. Join with people who are the place where you want to go. Uh, be around people like that. Network with people like that. And avoid the people who are trying to tear you down. And um, don't share your dreams with them, the ones who are tearing you down. And let them live to see it. Okay? So let's go live our best life. 
and a fulfilled life, okay? So that at the end of our days... Don't talk with food in your mouth. You see, I was talking a while ago with food in my mouth. And went, uh, uh, uh. So, yeah. Mm. Mm. Hello, family. Good morning. My morning is pretty basic. Early riser. But I'm going to start with my lemon water, you know, to clean the bowels out. Because you have to clean out what the grape is detoxing and getting out of your body, removing um abnormal cells and cleaning out any growth that's forming that should not be there you know so you need to flush it out in your urine and your poop and your sweat and your breathing and all that so a whole lemon or you can use lime juice alkaline alkalize your body and flush out your bowels once i do this with some water i will go to the bathroom within an hour or two um, I'm going to use some spring water because my distilled water is out. I need to get some distilled water. Can I rinse my teeth off with some water? And drink some water afterwards to rinse that harshness out of your um oesophagusted tube that goes to your stomach all right it's 6 18 a.m but i won't start eating grapes until uh 8 a.m because that's around when i stopped last night 8 p.m so it's 12 hours before you start eating grapes again but I'll still be drinking my water until then. Catch you later and have a blessed day. My grapes are running low. I pick up a little box and some seeded. So I will have to stock up today. And I don't know which one I'm... I think I want to juice these. Because I've been eating all day yesterday grapes. I think I want some grape juice to stock them on. So I'm going to juice these ones. And then I'm going to eat the rest of these for the day. And that will be it for the day. And then I'll stop up later for tomorrow. But guys, it is... um, It is... Week four and what? Two more days? Saturday will be the completion of week four. Okay? Remember yesterday, guys, I told you this one, this purple one was fresh. It wasn't sweet and it was tangy. And it was also sour. Because it was sour, it made my teeth feel on edge. So by the end of the day, I didn't feel like chewing anymore. Um, because the sourness makes my teeth feel on edge. I don't know if you know that feeling. So I have that memory in my head, so I don't want to eat anymore of this. Day, I'm gonna turn it into juice because the sourness I can't manage that on my tea today. So I'm gonna eat the the uh, seeded ones today because that one is sweet and it's not gonna make my teeth edgy. Um, and that's how you can play with it. The great fast continues. Saturday will be the completion of week four, so two days away from the completion of week four. All right, and thanks for those who are praying me on. I blended it with some water because I don't feel like juicing with my juicer this morning, as I said. So I added a little bit of water. Now I'm straining it. You can use a spoon or your hand. My hand is clean, so I'm pressing out the juice. about 700 mils
hundred knows. Okay, family, a little quick heart to heart talk. So for my male followers who have asked for something more directed toward males, it's coming. Um, I've spoken to the males in my life, um, friends and Guys, I thought I was recording just now. I wasn't. So yes, this is an update on uh, week four of the grave fast. What I've noticed or seen with my naked eyes or what I feel with my body. Um, my liver is still detoxing. Whatever the grape is cleaning out of my cells, the liver is also getting rid of it. And I will feel a pain like right here under my right breast. And I just drink more water and it flushes it out and the pain goes away. The pain just lasts like um, for... Uh, a few minutes or half an hour depending if you didn't drink the water so you drink the water it flushes it out the pain goes away um the fat is being shed the unhealthy fat you know that um or f the body stores toxins and poisons in fatty tissue so i'm seeing the grape cleaning away the um the fatty tissue that have the toxins as it removes the toxins so my body is getting leaner and leaner so so here is my juice I just made this morning, my grape juice. Of this sour tangy grape. It's still a little tangy, but there's some water in it, so it's tolerable. So my first serving of grape for the day, and the grape fast continues. I am starving because I've been drinking water since about 6.30. Um, I had my lemon water, and I've been other water but now i'm hungry so here goes the grape every two to three hours and the grape fast continues week four come on guys or why have to be strong enough and then we'll do it my why is strong enough okay catch you later so guys i still prepare you know other meals for my family and it's oh it's tempting sometimes when I smell their fragrance because on the grape fast also your senses are heightened. Your smell is increased. You know, everything is increased because your body is cleaning up so everything gets more brighter and more sense. You know, you pick up things much easier. Your, your thoughts, your dreams. So I smell the food and so the senses are increased. So... I still make meals sometimes for them. I told them I'm not doing much of that because I'm on my fast. But I still do it, especially for my daughter who goes to school with a teenager. But yeah. But um, I tell them after the six weeks and when I start the raw, I'm only going to prepare whatever plant-based thing I'm eating. Yes, yeah, so after the six weeks of brave fast only, um, when you read the book, it encourages a plant-based um, diet. So that's the next challenge. Uh, I plan to do that all the way to nine months to see the transformation and you will see the transformation also for my body, mind, soul, and spirit. And, um, I'm determined to do that. So if my family don't want to do plant-based, they're adults, uh, or they're old enough, they can make their own meals or, you know, if they don't want to eat the plant-based because, I'm not going to be tempted to deter from the path that's best for me. I've spent most of my life giving them what they want. Now it's time to focus on my health. And now they're at the stage in their life that they can do it for themselves if they don't want to comply. Because I can't and I will not force people to do what they don't want. Good morning, family, love and blessings. This is all the grapes I have left. Just a little sandwich bag of like about 15 I'm having that for my first meal of the day. And I'm going to the store to get more grapes. The grape fast continues. This is the ending of week four. And it seemed like my appetite is, you know, those cravings. They have been cut. Um, I just feel at peace. And I don't feel gluttonous for food or anything like that. I'm satisfied just with this amount. And I just eat like six already. And I'm feeling so peaceful and so good. So... Those are some more benefits of the grape fast. Catch you later. Guys, I'm not eating the seed. I'm not swallowing the seed because it's a little rough on the stomach. Um, so I just eat the pulp and the skin. And you know, you eat some pulp and skin for the day. So I'm spitting the seeds out. So I'll also get more grapes. Love y'all. Different varieties. 
We got purple grapes, green, black, and then they have them also in special containers. I'm gonna get some green. Everybody wants some variety today, so I'm gonna get some green. I'm still gonna get some black and red, but I'm feeling to start to eat some green the rest of the day. So yeah, the price is not that cheap today. Remember, I normally like one dollar something, but it's two ninety nine. But I think I deserve it, so I'm gonna get some of this. Then I'm gonna check the other store if it's the black ones is cheaper than two ninety nine. I'm only getting the green one at Shoprite. Okay, Walmart never fails. So black grapes is one seventy six a pound, seeded. 198 which is great and the green ones are still a bit up but a little less 240 something still and the purple are 180 so i'm gonna get a bit of each all right guys this is how i shop for my grape so this is what i'm getting i'm getting one two three four purple because i'm gonna juice some I'm getting two more green. Remember, I got two green at ShopRite, so I'm getting two more green at Walmart. Two bags of seeded and one bag of purple. Normally, one bag lasts me for one day or one and a half bag. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. But I'm getting nine because I'm gonna juice about three bags of black. And when you juice, it needs more to juice because I feel like drinking some juice as well as eating some. So yes, happy grape fast. Love you all. Good morning, family. Happy Saturday. Happy Sabbath. This is my rest day. I hope you all are taking a rest day and not going seven days a week overworking yourselves. You need to rest and reconnect. Take a rest day. So this is my rest day. Um, so I'm chilling. I'll be, I'm not rushing to get out of bed. I'm going to have my lemon water and around eight, I will start eating my grape. No, I'm going to drink some juice, grape juice this morning. I'll show you how much how juice I get from three bags of grapes, which is about three, four pounds or five pounds. So, you know, that will serve me for two days of juicing. Um, and I'll eat. And of course, the grape fast continues, guys. I'm nearing the finish line today. Saturday is the completion of week four. Um, so tomorrow is the beginning of week five. And I'm telling you, week four, I'm seeing massive improvement. Oh my gosh, my body is like sculpting. The grape is just cleaning away all the unhealthy cells and tissues. I'm like, there's no way I cannot but comply with um, my plant-based nine months that I plan to do after this because I can't. I'm so excited to see the transformation and you're going to see it too as it heals my body and makes me stay healthy. It reverses aging. It purifies your not just your inside, but your outside, your skin. Oh my God. Time for my lemon water. Let's clean those intestines out. Get out all the toxins that the grape cleaned out that's in my poop. This is what helps me go to the bathroom each day. This is my first serving of grape for the day. Um, this looks like about 500 or 450 mils. 100% grape juice. I feel like drinking some for the first this morning. 
it's a bit tart and it's not that sweet as i said not all grapes are very sweet some are fresh some are tart some are sour and um i just take my time and enjoy it love you all and have a blessed saturday look at all that juice the hamilton um big milk juice are left in my pulp i'm gonna wring this out this time i'm not blending it with water and i'll see how much juice i get because i'm not wasting any of my grape juice okay Look at all that juice, guys. All that juice that was left back in the pot. I'm squeezing this through a old strainable blouse I had. This is my juice, okay? And this is clean cloth. And this is what I'm using. I recycle stuff, okay? But here, all that juice. My goodness. All that juice, the Amazon juice, I would let you be wasting. Oh my gosh. Here, all that juice. I'm going to come and show you how much I got. Oh, the pulp that was left back. Here we go. This is my 700 ml cup. Let's see how much juice came out of the pulp. Look at that. 700 mils of juice would have been wasted. Oh, wow. So, I got these initially and I drank that, remember? And then this is the one I just got out the pulp. Are you kidding me? This would have been wasted. Not under my watch, okay? So 700 mils, this is about 600 mils, this is about 400 mils, and I drank about four to 500 mils. So that's all I got out of three bags of grapes. That's a lot. Happy grape fast.